Okay, we're back here um, now getting ready to torque this too thin. It did take us a little while to get this adjusted, both mesial and distal contacts, and uh, we are just a little lighter than his own teeth, but uh, at this point, Rich is, doesn't mind the, the new look here. So we're going to go ahead and get that torque down to 35 uh, Newton centimeters. Oh. Find our little drop in here. It's a star wrench. There we go. I'll just torque it down. You okay? That bother you at all? No. No. Okay. Is 35, right about there. All right. Now recheck, you bet. Recheck and contacts. That snaps nice. Snaps pretty good. That again. There we go. All right. That feel okay, Rich? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He's liking chewing already. So we're gonna put some Teflon tape down in there, also known as plumber's tape. <laughs> Believe it or not. Uh, not necessary. looking at our color. That's our C4, but we did get it back a little bit lighter than C4. Alright, here comes the Teflon. And just push that in place, like so. And that covers the screw head nicely for us and we just condense that down a little bit with a small little old amalgam plugger and we can just go right up with um, actually uh, we can do incremental bonding you can use paracore whatever you want to use uh, as uh, it doesn't matter and uh, condensing that in there nicely. That really does a nice job of sealing. It almost looks like plastic down, way down in there, beautifully condensed. Since this is zirconia, we'll come all the way up to the top and uh, place that composite in there as our final plug. And Rich can go enjoy eating steak tonight, or or chicken and fish. This is uh, self cure, dual cure, light cure, dent and shade. There we go. Go right in there. And just keep it, keep the tip in there and just, just inject. I like this paracore. I'll leave a little bit out there. I'm going to just show you real quick. Stay open now. You'll keep them open. This is our material from Weldent, uh, Coltine Weldent, uh, called Paracore. Um, I like the shade Denton. And you just inject it through that tip. And it's light curable. So we can speed things along, maybe make them adjustable. Um, we can get out of this procedure a little early, and Rich has got to come back for that cuspid. He's got a something fell off of that tooth, or he's got a void in it. And it, I think we can follow up on things too. Check his bite, etc. All right.
with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and adjust this uh, the bite and polishes pretty pretty nicely too, Paracor. So I have no problem with that. All right, that's it from this end. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you next time.